Hi, good evening. Yesterday, I went to Nagano Prefecture to climb a mountain with my colleagues. And uh, so today, I will talk about that. So let's get started. And uh, so yesterday, I took a train at 7 o'clock a.m. And the train is the series JR East series 353 uh, that name is Azusa 1 uh, it uh, go to the the train went to the Matsumoto station and uh, of course maybe you like to mountain are you like to climbing mountain are you like climb mountain so you know the name of the train the Azusa Ichigo, so which is very famous for the uh, people who like outdoor in the uh, mountain or hill. So, so that's why there are a lot of people in the train who are uh, preparing preparing for who are preparing for the uh, climbing mountain or outdoor activity, and many of people has a large have a large uh, rucksack and uh, they always have uh, they also have a lot of equipments for mountaining so as well as me i had a lot of uh, i had a lot of equipments for climbing mountain because uh, that was the uh, this was uh, my first time to climb mountain in the winter and uh, but actually i think it is very hard without the guide and this this time my boss uh, i i accompany my boss i accompanied my boss and he is as a uh, guide for us and uh, also, my colleagues who uh, who climbed the, who climbed the mountain yesterday was uh, had some experiences to climb the winter mountain. So that's why I am the only person who have never been to the climbing, been to uh, climb, been to winter mountain. So and I think this is the first time to use cramps. A, on my foot on my foot and I had to purchase a lot of equipment to go to the mountain because uh, and I didn't know that fact so I needed to, to purchase a uh, winter mountain shirts so I guessed that I imagined that it is okay to use the uh, mountaining shirts so which I use or oh, I use always in the mar in the summer and uh, other for other activities so but uh, before before uh, uh, before uh, after deciding to go to the winter mountain and uh, I my boss recommended uh, my boss uh, recommended to go to the mountain with and uh, I didn't know I hadn't know the fact I had to purchase the uh, mountaining shoes for winter and uh, so and uh, actually the cost for the shoes so that's why i talked about that I, I talked about that before in this vlog and uh, i purchased the wintering uh, winter shoes for the mountaining so that is a little bit expensive so that's why i decided to uh, rent other uh, equipment for the for this uh, uh, mountaining and uh, so some cramps uh, I part I I rent uh, cramps and uh, stocks and uh, the other small equipment and I purchased the uh, shoes in the shoes and uh, the pants for the with the Gore-Tex and uh, and my boss uh, my boss gave me a hard shirt for uh, my tops and uh, that's all so that is the all of the equipment and uh, 
Of course, this mountain is uh, very easy, and uh, my boss decided to dismount because uh, I and my colleagues not used to uh, didn't used to go wintering mount winter mountains. So that's why. I, so I think. Uh, so I think if the mountain were in summer, it would be very easy to. Uh, go to top of the mountain uh, because it takes about uh, only two or uh, only two hours walking uh, from the uh, under from the under the mountain to the top of mountain and but actually it is very difficult it was very difficult for me to walk with the cramps and uh, my leg was very fatigued uh, my leg was very tired exhausted because i think the shoe size is not a fit for me a suit for me and uh, my leg was very tired and uh, it is very hard to uh, climbing the mountain uh, oh, especially the last part of the only four one kilometers so if the it is it was a uh, it was a summer it were in summer it is very easy but uh, with the cramps that was very tough for me to uh, climb the mountain and uh, to climb st steep uh, steep uh, uh, steep hill so and uh, of course uh, but, uh, but my stamina is very uh, uh but uh, my stamina and uh, breath breath breathe is not so uh, difficult it's not so hard and but my foot and my leg is very uh, tired especially now for now and but i think there is no um, fatigue i have i feel i feel i hurt it i feel uh, i don't feel um, any fatigue for now and uh, and uh, so that i think that, that is very Easy mountaining, uh, but uh, that is very good training for the uh, winter mountaining, and so that's why, of course, I purchased the I had a purchase I have purchased a lot of uh, mountaining goods for the winter. So that's why I will I want to go to the I want to go to the winter mountain again and next winter. So and I want to try to the more difficult more difficult mountain but actually I want to uh, accompany with my boss or some guys because uh, uh, the winter winter mountain is very hard and uh, that is tough activity for the winter and uh, but uh, the the um, the view from the mountain so my boss said that the view from the top of mountain especially in winter is very beautiful and uh, he wanted to see uh, we, he wanted uh, us to see the, such a view but actually this yeah yesterday's weather was not so good so that's why and the window is very strong and uh, and the speed was uh, 26 23 or 26 uh, per hour 26 meter per hour so and uh, this is my first time to experience to have an experience and uh, such a strong window and i think that is very tough for me to standing to to resist to uh, resist against the strong window and uh, that was a little bit fun but uh, i think uh, the window the mountain is easy but the mountain is very difficult i think that is very dangerous for the people who are the who are in the first time for the their mountaining and uh, in, in winter so and uh, but actually i we could go to uh, we well we will be able to uh, reach the top of mountain and uh, we took some photos and that was very good memory for me and uh, as soon as i uh, we take we took talk we took talk we we took photo uh, we decided to, to go down to the mountain because of the strong window and the strong uh, snow and uh, the view from the view of the, the, the that is very there are a lot of crowds so that is very difficult to see around the the mountain and i think it is a um, i think uh, i don't think that to that i could see the see the see through more than one meter one meter 
So that's why the dog is, I, I think the dog is a little bit dangerous for uh, people who have not a uh, strong experience to climbing the winter mountain. So that's all. And uh, I will talk about the. Um, I will talk about the uh, today the plan. And uh, uh, we went to the shrine in the Nagano Prefecture, so that's why I will I want to talk about that yesterday at uh, tomorrow. So so that's all. Goodbye. See ya.